Let me just get this out there right now. Because I've been feeling pissed and been feeling some type of way for the past three days. Okay? For the past three days, I've been feeling some type of way, Miss Bitch. So by now, I'm sure that everyone knows what happened to me on Saturday and what I get kicked out for. I'm not even going to go there because I'm sure you already know. I'm not going to talk about that. And let me just say this. I know that it was completely inappropriate of what I did. Okay, I can understand why I got kicked out. I'm clocking my own damn tea, Miss Bitch. I know why I got kicked out. I can completely understand why I got kicked out. So, I'm not even going to sit up here and say, Oh, well, he shouldn't have kicked me out because of all this other shit, and I did not do anything wrong, and I'm in the perfectly right, and all this other shit. No, I completely understand what I got kicked out for. So I'm not even going to say that right now. However, that being said, I do not appreciate the way that the fucking pig, okay, this dumb, stupid-ass, whack-ass cop, did not escort my ass off the fucking premises properly, Miss Bitch. I've been feeling some type of way. Anyone that knows me real well does n knows that I do not like to be fucking touched. Okay, in a forceful manner. I don't like to be fucking touched by anyone. I don't care if it's your damn mama, bitch. I will fucking cuss her ass out too. But I couldn't do this. Because this bitch is a fucking cop. And you know that if you argue with a cop and if you disrespect and if you disrespect a cop, then all things just get worse and it's just not worth it. So I did not argue with the damn cop. Even though I wanted to though. I did say some shit to him, but I'm gonna get onto that later. My problem is, when that shit popped off, he did not have any fucking business coming up to me, just randomly grabbing me as hard as I can, as he could, fucking by my arm, nearly popped my arm out of place, miss bitch, and escort, and like, drag me out, dangling me from the fucking ground in front of everyone, all the way from the back of the building to the front door, he did that shit in front of everyone. And that's why I'm pissed off about. Do you know how embarrassing that is? Like, really. And I don't want to hear anyone else say and be smart asses and say, well, uh, you should have thought of that before you done the shit that you did. No, miss bitch. I, it's not like I was trying to get away from this queen. Okay? This donut queen. I was not trying to get away from him. He did not have any fucking business touching me. I can understand if he took me by the wrist. And he wanted me to go out because he did not trust me and thought that I would just run away. But yeah, I completely understand that. But I was not trying to get away. Like, bitch, why the fuck could you not, like, pull me to the damn side and ask me to leave and then follow me on my way out and stay there until I got in my damn car? Seriously, Miss Bitch, that was inappropriate. That was not, not inappropriate. Inappropriate. That was unnecessary of what you fucking did. You're talking about it was inappropriate what I did? Yes, it was. But also, you're in the fucking wrong, too. Because you did not have any fucking right touching me. Because I was not trying to get away from your ass. I was not posing a threat to anyone. I was just acting out of manner, as you put it. Yes, it was the wrong, it was the wrong place for that shit. But also... You did not have any fucking business doing that. And that's what I'm pissed off about. And now I see why people do not like the damn police. Because they fucking abuse their powers and take advantage of you sometimes. Like, bitch, just because you have a fucking badge does not mean that you can handle people any way that you fucking want. Get into it. Get into it. I don't like it when, I don't like it when anyone touches me force, forcefully. Okay, I could get it if I was trying to resist. Okay, and jerking him away, and then going back to um, my little posse over there. Yeah, I could see why he would grab me up and then drag me. But, Miss Bitch, I was not even trying to resist you. You randomly came up to me. Like I said, you nearly popped my fucking arm because you were holding me so damn tight, Miss Bitch. You fucking came up to me randomly. Oh, girl, you gotta go. All of this. No, Miss Queen. No, Miss Queen. And another thing, I thought that he was fucking playing with me at first because, um, he was playing around with a few other people over there. But now I see that he wasn't. And when I thought that, and now, and when I realized that he was not playing, I was like, oh shit, I'm really getting kicked out with a whole bunch of other of these queens. Like everyone fucking following me and shit. And it would not have been as bad if everyone was not watching. Like, I could see if everyone, like, if there was not many people there, or if there was only the owners and shit, but really, you had to do that shit in front of everyone, in front of little kids. 
You fucking whack ass donut queen cop. I fucking <laughs> bitch. You really you did not have to do that shit to me. And I even said that shit to him when he was waiting on me for my damn car to get there and pick me up. My people to pick me up. Miss bitch. I even said to him. I did not cuss him out, but I basically said to him, "Well, I did not appreciate the way that you um handled me on the way out." And he was like, "Well, you should have thought of that because um you should not have been doing doing the things that you were doing. You should have been prepared for that." And I was like, "Well, I was not prepared for that. I don't really see." the purpose of you handling me like the way you did that was n not necessary for me and then he just said okay whatever like miss bitch whatever because you're not the one that fucking gets pushed around all the damn time you think that just because you are a fucking badge you can treat anyone the hell, hell you want like I said I can see why people hate cops now because <coughs> this is not the first instance this is not the first experience I had with these queens I don't like cops I don't like cops, because in the past, this shit has happened to me, but not like this before. Like, cops have laid hands on me before, and they're not supposed to do that. For no necessary fucking reason, Miss Bitch. And I don't give a fuck what anyone else says. He did not have any... He did not have any necessary reason to do that. I was not trying to resist, and if you would have just pulled me to the dumb side and asked me to leave, I would gladly get my ass, walk my happy ass, my happy gay ass, my happy faggot ass, homosexual ass... Over to the damn door and left. And left, Miss Bitch. I'm not pressed about what he got, that I got kicked out. Like I said before, because I can completely understand why I get kicked out. I don't care if I get kicked out. Because like I said to you queens before, I come there every fucking weekend. And the only reason that I am not coming in there, and the only reason that I came there for the past um, weekends... Is because everyone in their damn mama is calling me up saying, Oh, Lele, you need to get your ass down here. It's not the same without you. We miss you. Like, they say that the... I feel fucking guilty, Miss Bitch, because I let them down. I would not come if people was not... Everyone, five, ten different people was calling me up on my damn phone asking me to come. It makes me feel some type of way. And if I don't come, then they want to get mad at me. Like, seriously, but uh, I'm not playing that shit anymore. To anyone that wants to call me and say, oh, you should come down, no. Because I don't really want to go back there anymore. If they are allowing that cop to do that, and furthermore, I'm just going to get on the skating rink stats right now, okay? How long is this? Seven minutes? <laughs> Seven minutes and 44 seconds. I got to make this quick. You claim to be family to the skating rink. <coughs> You claim to be family friendly and it's a safe environment. Miss bitch, if it was so safe, then why the fuck do you have a police officer here? You have little kids coming here and you claim that it's so safe and you can leave them here. We will watch after them. It's family owned. We are so friendly. Um, it's a safe environment. No, it's not, Miss Queen, because you if it was such a safe environment that you are portraying in your dumb false ass advertisement, your false ass advertisement, Miss Bitch, you would not have a fucking police officer there watching after everyone. Now, would you? Hmm. Not so safe to me. It doesn't sound so safe. Because clearly, you would have known that some shit pops up there sometimes. So, don't be saying that you are so safe and friendly, fam friendly, family friendly, whatever the fuck you want to call yourselves. Because that's not true. And to that damn cop, I don't, I don't, I don't remember his name because I looked at his badge number, his little name tag, Miss Queen, you did not have any fucking business doing that to me. And if I wanted to, and if I remembered your bag, your uh, little badge, whatever the fuck you wear, I would 